Hey, we are at Biltmore in Asheville, North Carolina. We're at the Biltmore Estate, and it's it's so big, I can't even get a good video of it. I'm gonna take you inside if I can and walk around and show you some stuff. But it's only gonna be just right in the entrance. We already did the tour and it was like an hour and a half. <laughs> I, I couldn't get any video in there at all. Um, because we were moving so fast and it's so crowded that I couldn't I couldn't get a good video. But look at this look at this place. This is the largest privately owned home in the United States. This is just the front. I mean, I have to show you a picture of how big this place is. But this is the main entrance to Biltmore. I'm going to take you inside. Let me show you the front of this beautiful place. These are the front doors going into Biltmore. Look at that. It's still decorated for Christmas. Look up there. Look at this beautiful, beautiful entryway. This, if you live near um, Asheville, North Carolina and come here, I would highly recommend it. It's, it's, I don't even know how to describe this place. It's gorgeous. So now we're inside. Okay. Look at this. Look how beautiful this is. Oh my God, right? And, and there's a tour and it goes all the way, it's about an hour and a half long and we just did it. Um, but everything is still decorated for Christmas and you come in here and look up there. Look at how beautiful that is. And you look down here and we have all these beautiful flowers and a piano. And there are Christmas trees everywhere. <laughs> There are so many Christmas trees here. Oh my God, it's just incredible. And you can see a view out here of the mountains. We're up in the mountains and you can see, if I can get over here, look at that. You can see, I mean, it's just, everywhere you look out, there's just the most incredible view. It is so, so beautiful. Now, I, I can't show you everything, like I said, um, but I'm going to walk around and see what I can show you on, on the main floor. There are over 200 bedrooms in Biltmore and over 100 bathrooms. Look at this. Look at this beautiful tree. Just look. Every room has different colors and different ceilings and things. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And it's just, I don't, I don't know, it's, it's hard for me to show you everything. It's, it's hard because it's really crowded, there are lots of people, and it's, it's, it's difficult. Do you look up here, look at that. It's a beautiful staircase. Now that spirals, I can't even get close enough to show you. This is the grand staircase, and it goes way up. And everywhere you go, there are Christmas trees everywhere. This is great. Let's show you this. Look over here. I'm going to walk over this way. Now, we spent an hour and a half touring the parts of Biltmore House that are open. There are quite a few places in here that you cannot see. They're not open to the public. But what you can see is truly just, it's just breathtaking this place okay now this is a banquet hall right here see and they have these guided tours that you can listen to and it tells you where you're going this is the banquet hall look at this tree right here look at this Christmas tree look at that and look at these big lights look I mean it's just look at how high up the ceiling goes it's it's incredible look up there look at can you imagine trying to get this Christmas tree in here it's um, it's unbelievable. And look how big those ornaments are. The ornaments are enormous. <laughs> and look at look at the woodwork up there. Look at that. And there's a there's actually a pipe organ. I don't know if you can see it, but those are the pipes up there for the pipe organ. Way way up there are the pipes for the pipe organ. And everywhere you go, there's this beautiful woodwork. All these solid wood doors are just, I don't know, it's just beautiful.
And we have tapestries hanging everywhere. Now back here, you can get a better view of this entire room. You can kind of see how big it is. And, and it's like everywhere you go, it's just every room is holds on a whole new surprise. I mean, look at the size of that ornament. <laughs> it's as big as a basketball. So, um, I'm actually waiting because see, when you do the tour, you have to kind of wait for people to get out of the way. Uh, it's, it's very, very busy here today. Look at they have around the trees, they have little toys and things like Christmas presents. Look at this little doll in a carriage, a little, a little pram. Look at this tree incredibly big <laughs> you can kind of see the pipe organ better the, up there now and they have down in the basement we saw it there's just one uh, a machine like a generator that powers that pipe organ look at this table it's just absolutely beautiful and you see they have chairs lining and then there are tapestries up everywhere the entire walls are just covered in these handmade tapestries. And look at that, look at that pretty Christmas tree over there. Isn't that gorgeous? I love the, the uh, decorations on the table. And in some of the locations, they will have someone working here that can tell you about it. Like, look at these beautiful chairs. There are so many of them in here. Um, they have um, there was a moose there and an elk and way up there you can see all these flags and this grand fireplace look at the size of that fireplace and there are fireplaces in almost every room look at that big light up there look at that beautiful tree um, George installed the, the, those pipes from the house is being built um, he laid his hands on a pipe organ, but at the same time he was building the All Souls Church and built more village. They needed an organ too, so guess who got the organ? It wasn't until 1998 that an individual donated a skin of pipe organ to the estate, so we finally had organ music after 103 years. <laughs> This is just a small part of it. I mean, it's, the tour is quite long and you won't believe some of the things you see. It's just, oh, it's beautiful. You can kind of see people going up the stairs up there. That's part of the tour. And down in the basement, the basement is spectacular. They even have a bowling alley and a pool down in there. It's great. Look at these chairs. to get it to make a video so I can really do it. I wanted to show you at least a little bit. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later.